Isabella Miller Jenkins, parental abductions are always horrible, tragic affairs, but one of the most controversial involves a lesbian couple named Janet Jenkins and Lisa Ann Miller. 2002, they both welcomed a baby girl named Isabella, who was conceived after Lisa was artificially inseminated. One year later, the couple had a seemingly amicable split and made an informal arrangement where Lisa would have custody of Isabella while Janet had regular visits. However, these arrangements ended after Lisa joined the ultra-conservative Thomas Road Baptist Church, that's in Lynchburg, Virginia, if anybody was kind of curious, prompting her to renounce her homosexuality while refusing to grant her former partner access to Isabella. This would be the start of a very heated legal battle that saw Lisa make unfounded accusations about Janet abusing Isabella. After Lisa accumulated thousands of dollars in fines for refusing to let Janet see Isabella, the state of Vermont found Lisa in contempt of court and awarded custody of the child, of the child to Janet. Lisa responded by disappearing with Isabella, and neither of them have been seen for over three and a half years. A felony warrant was issued against Lisa for kidnapping, and at least two Mennonite pastors have been charged with helping Lisa and Isabella flee the uh, country and escape to Nicaragua. Janet has also filed a civil lawsuit against Lisa, the two pastors, the Thomas Road Baptist Church, and other organizations for orchestrating Isabella's abduction, but the child has still yet to be found.